Okay, I went over the limit of time. Darn my... Oh my god! Inability to keep track of time. I did better with my LPs on the TV because... Well, I could see the time on iMovie. On this, however, it's a different story. I can't tell how long the video is going to be, so usually my videos are over 10 minutes. Lots of fun. So yeah, I had to speed up that video, and I probably sped up the part where I continued to fall off the cliff into the water numerous times. Because you don't need to see that in regular motion. I just fell off the cliff way too many times for it to be entertaining. Or comedy-like. Yes. Yeah. So you can't grab onto those with a double jump. You have to do it with a single jump. So in other words, you have to be careful. Otherwise you die. Ah. Can I have that box? I'd like that box. I'd like that Bat Ninja to come up here so I could give him peace of my mind. Crazy Bat Ninja. How do they even figure that out? I mean, bats? That lacks logic. And chicken. And all sorts of things that it should have. The like geese. Geese! Would you like some geese on that, sir? Oh boy, what's up here? Nothing useful, except for more shurikens. Oh boy, the boss! Let's shoot at him! Ow. Jeez, buddy. Ah. Uh. Okay. I'm guessing there's a second form, otherwise... Oh yeah. That would have been quite pitiful. Oh great, now he grabs his shield and a gun out of the water. That makes perfect sense, and I believe we have to shoot his gun. I was going to say his head, but nope. They never said that. Oh no, they didn't. And why does it seem like I'm not being damaged by anything? Ow. Ah. Stop shooting missiles at my face. It's offensive to my chicken. My chicken powers of ninja-ness. Ha! You have no shield. I forbid you to have a shield. Use of shields in water is prohibited by law. And by Quadraxis 14. Yes. Yay! He exploded more! He exploded more! He's just turned into a big, splody wreck of shard machinery and stuff. Ow. Missiles? Not helping, buddy. You're just prolonging your death. Or maybe I'm prolonging mine. Nope. I was only prolonging your death. Oh yeah, I'm on a jet board in the water with a sword, and I blew him in half. Funny thing is, we never even use a sword. We have two knives and something else. Now, Electric Demon. Oh god, I remember this level. Oh god, landmines and burning forest and pollution and death and more SWAT team. We're just going to call them SWAT Team, because I can't think of a better name. Ooh, I broke his gun in half. Take that, buddy. Ah! Great! That's good to know. These things that have danger signs on them actually are hazards. This game is starting to make sense. It's just danger, so you should beware of... Danger. I don't know, this game makes more sense than some of the games I've played. In other words, Prince of Persia, Earthworm, Jim, and about every other LP I've had. Oh, Lord. Bad memories. 
But this game is challenging yet fun. That's the awesome thing about it. It's not too easy. It's not too boring like Clock Tower. I mean, Clock Tower is good and all, but I can usually never sit through the whole entire game. If you're noticing, like, the, the pallets or the items, like, the objects are kind of switching around looking, like, all of a sudden they're kind of getting all zappy looking. I don't know how to explain it, like... Yeah, like that. They seem to, like, separate for a second there. Um, I'm not sure if you noticed that, but, like, that happens a lot on my Genesis emulator. And a lot of the time on my Nintendo emulator... Not my Super Nintendo emulator, just my Nintendo emulator. Um, I'll get, like... The screen scrolling thing. Maybe that's just natural for the Nintendo, but I'm not sure. Ah, oh, crap. I'm gonna use this. Because it's always good to keep your lives good and stuff. Ooh, and it destroys everybody on screen. I did not know that. But yeah, this is a really useful thing for not dying. In other words, it is good for you. Shinobi, stop kicking the ground and throw a ninja thingy at him. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this game does have some pretty good music, and this reminds me of a level from Sonic and Knuckles, I think. I love the 2D Sonic games. I hate the 3D ones. I can't stand those. I mean, the dialogue is just crappy. The games are usually a bit crappy. I stopped playing, or, no. I used to play them, but now I just don't. I really don't like, um, 3D Sonic games. Oh god, it's this guy again, and he's got warping abilities! Or, no, not warping. He's just crazy, that's all. He's just misunderstood, that's all. And he's yellow, and he shoots strands of evil at us. See? Those are strands of evil. Evil in its purest form. Strands. Oh crap, now he's gonna warp all across the stage a ton. Ha! Take that! Roar! Oh, I suppose we do have a sword, we just have to use that charge ability. Now then, we're inside of a factory! With some high-tech piece of stuff. Whoa! Oh crud, this is what I remember. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is what it does. And if you'll notice, there's some sort of Godzilla in the background. You'll understand why, eventually. And when you do, you'll think, what the heck is going on? Wait, nah, I'm gonna forget about that. I was figuring I could slide kick or something, but maybe I can, maybe I can't. I don't have the patience to find out. Patience. Patience, my friend. Grammar, God. Oh. Does this just lead to doom? Oh, it's all coming together now. I get it. Okay, okay, okay. Now, we want to explode that one. Whoops. There we go. And now, we're in this area. Did that? Yeah, this did something. Uh, why can't I? Ah! Great, now I'm stuck. I hope you're happy. Ah! Maybe I have to use my ninja skills of doom. Ah! By falling off a cliff. Yeah, that's some ninja skills of doom for ya. Okay, there's probably an extra life under there, but I'd rather not waste any more lives. In fact, I should probably stop the episode here before I run out of time like I always do! Boom! So I figure we'll stop right about here. Splody! Okay. So yeah. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.